look at these wrapped cakes in a box. Aren't they cute? It's holiday season and we always look for that perfect gift. And this is an idea. And if it happens that you bake and sell cakes, this is a great idea for your clients to try your cakes first before you can pick the flavor, especially for weddings and big parties. So this is how I made them. I made six different flavors of cakes. All of them are 9 by 13 and I cut them in, into three equal parts. I cut the bottom and make sure that each cake is only an inch and a half. And I also made six different fillings, a combination of whipped cream and buttercream. And of course, the flavor of your filling should complement to the flavor of your cake. So this is a chilled cake and I cut it in half. It's easier to cut if it's chilled. And I lined both of them so it's easier for me to cut. So the thickness is about an inch and I use a serrated knife. But since this is carrot cake, so the cooked shredded carrots get stuck on the blade easily. So just slice the rest and put it on the side and let's move on to our old gray tea cake with orange zest and juice. The other flavor that I did is red velvet with mascarpone cream. This one is cookies and cream with cookies and cream filling. As you can see, I started carefully wrapping each one of the slices of the cake and I actually have three more flavors that I sliced and wrapped one by one. I have ubi flavor with ubi cream, carrot cake with pineapple cream, and lastly, I have the chocolate cake with strawberry cream. So I bought a template from Etsy so you can personalize your labels. And that's what I did and have my son did it for me, thank God. So I have this six by 12 box that I bought from Amazon. And um, before I put this shredded paper, I put some lining first. And then the shredded paper, you can buy it from Party City, Walmart, Michaels maybe. And um, I have all these printed out. So the cookies and cream is a little taller because I forgot to trim the bottom and then I went way far for the, the for the ube so that's why it's a little shorter and then the other four they're uh, they are more or less five inch um, ha, um, tall so now it's time to assemble the cakes we have the six different flavors with six different fillings and um, these shredded paper will help the cakes be in place and not go anywhere. And I want them to be a little bit tilted. Um, and these uh, labels that I made, I kind of match them according to their flavors. Like the chocolate, of course, it's brown. And then the carrot cake should be like a little orange. And then the Earl Grey, because the tea is actually more like a brown orangey color even though the cake is not so i still went for that color and the cookies and cream has a little dots on it and it was my son's idea because it represents the cookies in it not just the cream so it's actually it's actually a cute idea it, though it's simple but it's really really fun and they're cute and very elegant so now we have this and you can put your logo and this rolled sticker to seal the box, I got that from Shein or Sheen, whatever, you, how you pronounce that. But I got it there, even the lining paper. Actually, the other, the rest of my cakes have lining paper. The, just this one, I forgot about it, I'm sorry. But then it's time for us to sell these and post it on Facebook so that people will know that you have these different flavors in a box. Thank you.